see Charlie with all of his crazy smash tech, and now you got Key. Key's Twitter, bro. Every day he's like, Yo, look at this new snake combo training I got. Training room combo. I think if there was a training room PR, Key would be up there, bro. I want to see him <laughs> in a combo contest for snake. A combo contest? That would be pretty bro, cool. Bro, a snake like combo it. contest would be hype. That'd be hype. Here we go. Game one, of course, on PS2. A new starter, yeah. though. So what no, do you think of this matchup? Me, okay, I haven't seen much of it. I know, I know the things Wolf could do to Snake. I know that for sure. I know like the down smash on Cypher. He's combo full. He could practically hit him off everything. But I don't know what Snake can do uh, to Wolf. That is like really, like, you know, like can he edge guard him really hard or no? He he can decently edge guard him with up B. You, that doesn't really beat out. It doesn't. His up B doesn't lose to Nikita that often. You have to get it before it starts out, because if the hitbox comes out, he'll just go through Nikita. It'll lose to Wolf Flash, or it'll, yeah, it'll lose to Wolf Flash, all that. So Snake can edge guard him, but he has to have the read. That's going to be a really yeah. hard <laughs> thing, that down smash. Wow. Yeah, that's it, a <laughs> It's practically free if Snake goes low. He has to time his recovery really well. Yeah. Free. Yeah. So is it, uh, is there anything, like, in the boxing game? Can Snake really get Wolf off? Does he have any good get off me moves on Wolf? He really just has down air, and then if he's getting comboed, if it's going to be a long combo, he can hope to grenade. But other than that, most of the time he just has to take it or just hope to get the mix up. Oh, Was that a shield break? Yeah, he got a shield break. What he What's he? Bro, down he's smash. mashing. So which one's the harder part, the front part or down part? I uh, honestly, I don't know. I think, I think it's the down part because that mean, would make sense. I mean, the front, the, the front or back? The yeah. back hit. Yeah. I think it's the back hit because that's usually how a lot of down smashes yeah. work, but both sides are just so strong. Yeah. Okay, oh. throw. Still not going to kill though. Yeah. Here. Here comes here. Oh, wow, good for it, though. Wow, well, I'm surprised you made that back. I'm going to try to recover real fast. This, this is a really. This is really interesting. Like, and another cool thing, I mean, outside of like, I don't count the other game, but like, the cool thing about Ultimate, like, you're seeing a lot of veterans meeting for the first time. Mm -hmm. Well, obviously they're not they're not meeting for the first time, but like it's been a while since we last seen these guys fight each other. Snake and Wolf. This was really cool to see them. I yeah, haven't seen them since Brawl. <laughs> yeah. So it's really cool to see them behind the meta again. Yeah, right now Key's not getting a chance to really set up any of his traps or kind of get his game going. It's just him playing against Charlie right now or Charlie's game, and Charlie's just kind of. Oh, nice. That was so good. Yeah, that was really good. Yeah, you can't never count on Snake. Snake always has a. Okay, now I can see what we can do to the edge guard wolf. Okay, cool. Good to know. Yeah, and now this game is somewhat if... Okay. Oh, no. That's so oh, that was cool. clean. That was so cool. Now you got a free edge guard on him. Oh, here we go. Keep bringing it. Now, if he gets this, he can't come up with a snow. This, <laughs> this game is even. <laughs> it's somewhat even, right? I would like to believe. Yeah. Also, another interesting part is the fact that a snake can actually crawl underneath the laser, so... A lot of the times you'll just see Key crawling when Charlie's just shooting these lasers, so it's a way to get around it. Oh wow, it's Key's bringing it back right now. He, he, well, it's and all back. Wait a minute. <laughs> all in, and now he has the edge guard on him. Oh my goodness. Probably he probably in a tough spot. That up tilt, he's an up tilt. Oh, he needs to be careful. Uh, he's going to do it twice. <laughs> that move is a two peat. That uh, It's two hits. <laughs> nah, bro, it's, it, it's three hit. You forgot about a spot dodge double up oh, tilt. Yeah, I, for that, <laughs> I forgot that's the wind up, right? <laughs> Oh, he brought it all the way back to a point where now Charlie's in there. Now he got the Nikita. Oh, wow. He really brought it back. So that's what I'm saying. Can't count out Snake. Snake's never down, bro. Oh, a par versus Soldier. Oh, nice. I don't know if that was Master or Charlie wanted to grab release. Almost dying to that. Oh, he's... Oh. Okay, but now hey, Charlie's... This is a really close game. Me, either one of these men can win at this moment right now. Yeah, but next grab uh, for Snake, that's going to be it. Yeah. And oh, my God. It, it looked Charlie's. like he forgot about it. Ah, it kind of looked like he reacted faster than Charlie. It, it, that one right there just looked like he reacted faster than Charlie. Yeah, hey, Charlie was just sitting there shielding, and then you could tell he realized that he needed to leap, but by that time he was already in Snake's arms. So still, if you saw the first half of that game, you would have thought, all right, Charlie's got this free. Yeah, he did some really cool, really cool conversions. He got that down smash at 70. He broke his shield. It didn't kill, but... Yeah, the Snake, and after he broke the shield, he just wrecked up all the damage and brought him all the way up there. Yeah, you really can't ever count out Snake. He just, no, he just, he can always bring it back. He's just always blowing you up, blowing himself up. Game's not over. There you go, game two on FD. Really good, really good stage. Oh. Down there, but that's not good. Charlie gets, I think that's like, he gets that combo so hard. It's really cool. Hey, it's so clean to, to see, honestly. 
You might have went to FD maybe for the uh, maybe for the C4, <laughs> maybe to camouflage with the C4 with the background in the stage. Cause C4 and uh, Castlevania, F all oh, oh. killing others. Not Castlevania, That's you can't see that. You can't see it. Even with, <laughs> and this is probably like the second closest. So. Yeah, in other regions, uh, a lot of snakes would go to Unova for the same reason. Oh. <laughs> you can see, but here you go. Kind of starting out last game. Look, Charlie taking the first luck with down smash. We know Charlie's really good at adapting. So, oh my goodness. Was that fair in there, the dash tech? I love These combos from Charlie, they're always so fun to watch. Because so you can tell he just allowed it for so long. Yeah. Right now, it just... Oh, got it, another... It just looks like that Charlie is gonna win a lot of these, a lot of these interactions like nine times out of ten as long as he doesn't go off stage. Yeah. When he got him off stage, he took so much percent, but on the ground, yeah. oh my goodness. Charlie has it. It's a can you di that or is that just true? It's it's basically true. But that has to be oh wow. <laughs> it, it's it's aggravating. <laughs> I've seen if you don't get a frame perfect, a lot of times people can shield, but <laughs> since the buffering system's so lenient in this game, it's not hard. Yeah, it just, it just doesn't look like it should be true. He's having a hard time getting this kill on Charlie. Oh, that was weird because he got the grab at 150, so he could have gotten a free uh, free F tilt. Yeah, I, he could do like a few pummels, but hey, he still got the stock number less. There you go. Right up there. Oh, oh, if he was on, oh, that would have been a cool combo if he got it. If the C4 was where he knocked Charlie. I'm pretty sure he was just expecting Charlie to roll in. Oh, that's really close. He's always showcasing cool snake stuff. There you go. Breaking up the damage. And that's like, Snake's like the ultimate momentum character. He just, he just keeps going. He can't stop. You know, once the Snake mess up his movement, his patterns, whatever, he's, he's lost. But yeah. you see Key here just bringing it back untouched, just really controlling the field. Snake is so dangerous. Wait, he died? Yeah, he died, yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> Snake is so dangerous with momentum. Yeah, he, like, that's what I'm saying, especially with the way he Okay! Oh, I thought he died. Nah, he wouldn't have. If Snake had, like... Maybe if he did drag down, no. Yeah, if he just did run off air, that definitely would have. No, killed. no, he did it, but I don't know what move he could have done afterwards. If maybe if he did some swaggy stuff like a C4 or what, stuff. You know, he had. Oh, what? That was down to. I was like, oh wow. He needs to be good. Look at it. The game's even again. Like, oh, oh that's gonna be it though. Yeah. yeah. That was definitely yeah. scary. He. You know, Cause Charlie got uh, caught using the jump on that back throw too, but the good thing was he they were high enough up, yeah. so Wolf still had uh, the means to recover. Yeah, Charlie. Wow, well, that game, that game went from like convincingly to Charlie to I'm like, oh man, Key's about to bring this back. So, wow, it is, it is kind of crazy because like Snake reminds me of like that. Do you know when we play free for all, like mm -hmm. one for one free for all with items, and the person that takes the first stock just steamrolls because they're getting the Pokeballs, getting the yeah. they're getting their what, They're getting their setups. Yeah, that's what getting. So that's what it feels like with Snake. After I feel once Snake beats somebody, I kind of feel like he's getting, like, I feel like he's pulling his items, pulling, you know, like, <laughs> yeah. he's just getting everything. Once you give Snake, like, five seconds, he's like, all right, what's the game plan? And like you said earlier, uh, Castlevania, he counterpicked to that yeah. stage. You went to Castlevania? Yeah. Because you can't see it at all, right? Pretty much. It's still such a pretty stage. So, yeah. Especially like the moon and the bats. Like, I love what you do with the backgrounds. There you go. Game two, number three. Mm. Wow, actually neutral get up being the... Uh, what? Oh, wow. Okay, so what he did was he did the uh, the wolf flash. He held it down to get that low angle, but he didn't hold... He didn't let go of holding down, so he just kind of went through the stage. That's unfortunate. That's very unfortunate, because as you see... Oh my goodness. He got that three, three games in a row, first stock. <laughs> three, three times. Oh man. Yeah, evening back up. Charlie not too not too upset by that SD. He's already evened it back up. Yeah, oh my. There you go. Oh, what put an air out of shield, why not? There you go. These guys going back and forth hitting each other. Mm. Oh, Again? One. But it's like so is he dying because like dude, you know how there's more head damage in this game? Is yeah. it because he's hitting his head is why he's dying so fast? I feel like that's probably the reason. Uh, but another reason also is probably because Key, whenever he does these up he does jump up B. Hold on. So if you're wondering, Cypher actually has an 8% based armor. So if you're actually able to hit it above 8%, you not only hit the Cypher itself, but you also hit Snake. Oh yeah, I, yeah. That, I was wondering why he's dying so fast. Is oh, it's 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 because the sweet spot for down smash is like really really big. It's like it's stupid broken. Sorry, I just had to say it. 
<laughs> yeah. So yeah. So he has like he's like killing my eighty percent. He's dying so fast and snake heavy, and he's just yeah. Cause he's leaving like he's a lightweight. Yeah. Cause do you know how like there's more damage in the head in this game? Yeah. I wonder if that plays a part now, but who knows? Yeah, when Shinny uh, told me about that, or he told me that you told him about it, like I checked it out, I was like, wow, that's that's crazy. That's a lot of work Sakurai puts uh, in. Yeah, he did. Uh, did I he, think he's dead. He, uh, he killed himself. Oh, oh, uh, just barely. Uh, I wonder, was, did he go? Was it? I wonder if the keto was a misinput, or was I, he trying to go for the? I feel like that was a misinput. Because honestly, cause that did look like a cool little edge guard he could potentially try to do. Yeah, I feel like if that was on purpose, it was a cute idea, but it just it just seemed like it wasn't wouldn't have been a good idea because Nikita's it's like frame it comes out on like frame forty and that just leaves you in the ground uh, in the air for a while, so it's just really risky to come back. So that like that might have been an all or nothing play, or that might have just been a miss input. Did he bring it? He almost bring it back again. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, down smash twice at like fifty. No, oh, this is like really cool. Like it's. I like how Charlie is not, you know, he's not throwing it away by like having a lead and going to games. And I know he was, he he's really hard on himself about that, and he's really doing a good job just keeping his composure and just closing out the games. Mm -hmm. Because a player like he, like a player like he will will do that to you, you know. He really puts you on your brink. And it feels like he gets a plow on, like powered up on this third stock. <laughs> I don't know if it's about Key's third stock, but he's like on some other stuff. Yeah, one, once his uh, back's to the wall, it seems a bit like when he's really turning it up. Yeah. Or the fact that Charlie's like getting comfortable and like giving Key that chance. Either way. Oh, oh, yeah. oh there you go. Yeah, uh, the wolf did a. a oh, the wolf. Okay. Charlie did a nair afterwards, so that's the, I think the only reason he was alive still. Okay, Charlie's playing really well. Charlie's been. He's really been in the lab. He's been like. He's really doing his thing right now. He still wants, he wants to be the best. He's gonna show the world he can be the best. He's not giving up. Resiliency is key. Charlie has it. Oh, not gonna die that time. I don't know. I kind of accepted that he was dead there. Yeah. Oh, like Charlie. Oh, here we go. Wake up, up, Joel. Yeah, go ahead. This can do it. Charlie's been really good. He's been really consistent on these, uh, on these close, on these games where he can close it out. He seemed to like really correct his mistakes, see what he's doing wrong, and then he just goes to like out neutral you. And yeah. every and every time you see Key bring this back, honestly, it's not like it's not like Charlie getting comfortable, like you said. It's genuinely just Key doing something really smart and just like, really innovating himself. Yeah, and then that's like playing on the ledge and racking it all up like right here right now if key gets him on the ledge and he gets his little setups going it's going to be that that's where key racks up the most damage and that's where he brings the game back oh nice well, i don't i don't really agree with that idea of trying to challenge with the back air uh, i don't agree with the f tilt just hitting in there oh yeah you're right no <laughs> <laughs> he, he did like an angle downward f tilt and still hit him in the air <laughs> still swiped him out of there yeah that's, that's a good point <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Key with the parry. Charlie looking to close it out. Ooh, nice. That was such dodge. a great recovery. Yes, it was. He's not trying to fall in for I think he oh. Up tilt. Oh no. Never yeah, mind. I also expect an up tilt. I would have up tilt, but hey, I'm I'm not the one in winter semis right now. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Uh, and right now it's nice. looking like looking like Charlie's looking to close us out. Yeah, but we've seen these last few. Oh, there it is. Oh, wow. Yeah, don't touch See, my shield. <laughs> he likes saves without. That's what I'm telling you. Like the elimination game, Charlie starts to play really well. He did really well in a lot of those games. I felt a few. I think game two was the one where I felt he.